Hello and welcome to A Journey Through Time. Today we travel back billions of years to explore Earth's prehistoric past. Our destination, the time before the dinosaurs, a period spanning incredible geological eras. Imagine a time when our planet was a hot volcanic wasteland. And this was Earth's beginning. Over millions of years, things changed drastically. The oceans formed. Then in these primordial waters, life first appeared. Our story takes us through vast stretches of time, from the Precambrian to the Paleozoic eras. We'll witness incredible events like the Cambrian explosion and meet the bizarre creatures that inhabited our planet. Get ready to explore a world vastly different from our own, a world teeming with strange and wonderful life forms that paved the way for the dinosaurs and eventually us. Our journey begins in the Precambrian era, the largest period in Earth's history. This era spans from the planet's formation around 4.6 billion years ago to about 542 million years ago. The early Earth was a harsh place. Volcanoes erupted, spewing lava and gases. The atmosphere was toxic and the land was barren rock. Yet in this extreme environment, life emerged. The first life forms were single-celled organisms, simple bacteria and archaea. They lived in the oceans, feeding on chemicals from hydrothermal vents. These tiny organisms were the ancestors of all life on Earth. The Precambrian era was a crucial period for life. It was a time of incredible innovation as life adapted to the harsh conditions and slowly transformed the planet. As we move into the Paleozoic era, approximately 542 million years ago, we encounter a pivotal event, the Cambrian Explosion. This period marks a dramatic burst in the diversity of life on Earth. Suddenly, the oceans were teeming with strange and wonderful creatures. Trilobites with their segmented bodies and compound eyes scuttled across the seabed. Anamalacaris, a large predator with fearsome appendages, hunted its prey. The Cambrian explosion saw the evolution of many major animal groups we know today, including arthropods, mollusks and vertebrates. This explosion of life forever changed the face of our planet. The Ordovician period, following the Cambrian, witnessed the continued diversification of life. Trilobites flourished and cephalopods, the ancestors of squid and octopus, became dominant predators. But perhaps the most significant event of this period was the rise of vertebrates. Early fish with their bony skeletons and streamlined bodies began to navigate the oceans. These creatures would eventually give rise to all vertebrates on land, including ourselves. The Ordovician ended with a mass extinction, but life persevered and continued to evolve. Section 5. The Paleozoic Era, Life Conquers Land. The Silurian period marked a critical transition in Earth's history. Life began to colonize the land. Plants, simple at first, established themselves on the shores, gradually transforming the barren landscape. Invertebrates, like millipedes and spiders, followed plants onto land, adapting to this new environment. The Silurian period set the stage for the further evolution of life on land. The Devonian period, often called the Age of Fishes, saw a remarkable diversification of fish. Sharks appeared and bony fish developed lungs which would eventually allow their descendants to breathe air. Towards the end of the Devonian, the first amphibians, creatures capable of living both in water and on land, emerged. These pioneers paved the way for the evolution of reptiles, mammals, and eventually us. Section 6, the Ordovician period, a world of trilobites and early cephalopods. The Ordovician period was a time of continued innovation in the oceans. Trilobites reached their peak diversity with thousands of species inhabiting various marine environments. Some were small and simple while others grew to impressive sizes with elaborate spines and ornamentation. Early cephalopods, relatives of modern-day squid and octopus, also thrived during this period. These intelligent predators possessed tentacles lined with suckers and could change color and texture to camouflage themselves. The Ordovician oceans were a riot of life, with creatures we can hardly imagine today. Section 7, the Silurian period. Fish evolve, jaws and plants move onto land. The Silurian period marked a turning point in Earth's history as life began its conquest of land. While the oceans teemed with diverse creatures, the land remained a barren landscape ripe for colonization. 
One of the most significant developments during this period was the evolution of jaws in fish. This key adaptation allowed fish to become more efficient predators, dramatically impacting life in the oceans. Meanwhile, on land, the first plants began to appear. These early pioneers were simple, non-vascular plants, much like mosses and liverworts we see today. They played a crucial role in transforming the barren land, paving the way for the evolution of more complex plant life. Section 8. The Devonian Period, the Age of Fishes. The Devonian period, often referred to as the Age of Fishes, witnessed an explosion in fish diversity. Sharks, with their cartilaginous skeletons and sharp teeth, emerged as formidable predators. Bony fish, the group to which most modern fish belong, also underwent significant diversification. One of the most remarkable adaptations during this period was the development of lungs in some fish. This crucial step in vertebrate evolution allowed these fish to breathe air enabling them to survive in shallow, oxygen-poor waters and eventually venture onto land. The Devonian also witnessed the evolution of the first forests, with trees reaching impressive heights. These early forests provided habitats for the first land-dwelling invertebrates, setting the stage for the evolution of terrestrial ecosystems. Section 9, a final word the importance of understanding our prehistoric past. Our journey through Earth's pre-dinosaur past has taken us through billions of years, from the planet's formation to the rise of life on land. We've witnessed incredible events like the Cambrian explosion and the evolution of the first vertebrates. Studying these ancient periods is crucial for understanding the history of life on Earth. By learning about the creatures that came before us, we gain a deeper appreciation for the complexity and fragility of life. The story of life on Earth is a story of adaptation, extinction and survival. By understanding our planet's past, we can better prepare for its future.